Welcome to my channel. Apoon Wi-Fi Extender Setup and Reset Apoon Wi-Fi Extender Setup via WPS button Unbox your Apoon Range Extender device and plug it into the power socket near the host router. Make sure both Wi-Fi antenna of Apoon Wi-Fi Extender directions toward the upside to getting the proper signal from the host router. Plug your Apoon Range Extender into the power outlet near the host router. Go to your host Wi-Fi router and press the WPS button for 2 seconds. Within 2 minutes press WPS button for 1 second on Apoon Extender. After connection with the main Wi-Fi router extender signal LED will start glowing. Check your mobile Wi-Fi after 20 to 30 seconds you will see one more Wi-Fi SSID name Wi-Fi network underscore EXT, your existing name with EXT will configure as signal booster SSID name. Apoon Wi-Fi Extender Setup via Web Browser Plug-in Range Extender Device to a Power Socket near Wi-Fi Router Go to the Wi-Fi option from Mobile and connect to the Apoon underscore Wi-Fi SSID as shown for your Range Extender model. Open a Web Browser of your choice. Type the default Apoon Extender IP address HTTP colon slash slash 192.168.11.1 in the address bar. You will get a range extender login page asking for the password. Choose your language and use the default password admin and press the login button to access settings. As Apoon Extender supports multi-wireless mode, AP, repeater. Router so to set up in range extender mode choose the repeater option. Click repeater option and wait a few seconds while repeaters scanning for network and load all Wi-Fi names running nearby. Select your Wi-Fi name from the list and provide your existing Wi-Fi security key. You can change the extender name differently from host name or you can use the default name. The Apoon Wi-Fi extender setup is complete. Now, you can unplug the extender and place it in the dead zone. Reset Apoon Wi-Fi extender setup. First, you need to turn on the Apoon extender. Next. Locate the reset button beside the WPS button. Press and hold it for the moment the reset LED light blinks. When the LED indicator flashes, wait for a few seconds and the light will become stable. Once the LED becomes stable, it means that the reset process is complete and you can configure it again. Thank you for watching.